Welcome to the Emily Carr University of Art and Design Library keyword searching tutorial. In this tutorial, you will imagine that you are doing research for a visual culture course, and you've decided to write a paper on a public art piece by Mafambi McLeod, a Vancouver-based artist. You will learn a few ways to search for information on your topic in the library catalog. You can then apply these skills to your future research assignments. Let's begin by going to the library catalog. You may start your research by typing the name of the artist as a keyword. The subject search for her name would bring only items that deal with her as a subject, while the author search would retrieve only the items written by her, so keyword search is the most inclusive and useful for our general purpose. Also, if the name of the artist you're searching is very common, you might want to put it between quotation marks to be searched as a phrase. The resulting search consists of nine items, including slides, artist files, exhibition catalogs, and special collection items. If, however, you were only interested in artist files, for example, there is another way to search for a file on a particular artist. Use the Home icon to refresh your search screen. To search for artist files, select Series and type in Artist File. You could either search alphabetically by the last name of the artist, or you could navigate to the advanced search and at the last name of the artist. This way we get the exact artist file that we're interested in. If for your assignment you need to use artist books, you could locate some relevant ones by searching subject and artist books. You could then look for related artist books by expanding various categories on the left. For research on public art, I could expand the subject tab and find street art. Now, if you needed to expand your search to include a broader topic, you could try searching by keyword for public art Vancouver. As a result, you would get a few recent books on the subject. A similar search for public sculpture in Vancouver would retrieve a number of exhibition catalogs. Remember to use the subjects on the left to give you ideas for alternative keyword searches such as outdoor sculpture. Search for public art sculpture will give you a variety of exhibition catalogs, video, and book items. It is important to keep in mind that how you search for information on your topic will affect your results. For example, a keyword search for public art gives you 799 results, as the system is not searching for public art as a phrase, but rather as two words, public and art. This is why you might get titles such as Public Monuments, Art and Political Bondage, which might not be directly relevant to your search subject. Keyword search for public art in quotation marks, however, gives you 132 results, while subject search for public art in quotation gives you 87 results, being the most precise. If you want to narrow down further, choose title search for public art in quotation marks, and you would only get 41 results. If your instructor requires you to use other sources of information not covered in the library catalog, you can search for newspaper articles in databases such as Canadian Newsstand and CBCA Reference. And for journal articles, you could try JSTOR or Artful Text, which you can find under the Databases tab from the library homepage. And remember, the keyword searching techniques that you can use in the library catalog also apply to your database searches.